Hey guys, uh, so this is just a quick video uh, on the 2009 FX50. Uh, the head gasket, uh, or not head gasket, should I say. Uh, the uh, Blue Devil, sorry. The Blue Devil sealant that I put in there. So, as you guys can see, all the coolant is on the floor. I'm not really sure what happened. Uh, I was just sitting here in the driveway and I was uh, just changing the cabin air filter. Yeah, I was just sitting in here changing it, and out of nowhere, I just, I, I you know, I look to the uh, garage and I see a, you know, I see a lot of water on there, and then I come out and I see just all this antifreeze leaking everywhere. I'm not sure what happened. Um, I haven't even opened it yet. I just threw some water on it right now. It literally just happened minutes ago, and it's just freezing outside. I can't really, I can't really take a look at it. But we're gonna we're gonna attempt to check out what's going on. So um, I don't think it's leaking from the same place that it was leaking before. Um, obviously something happened. I'm not sure what happened, but I can see. Yeah, I can definitely see coolant right here um, because I had washed all this. I had washed the engine bay. Looks like it started leaking here. Uh, something failed. Something definitely failed and the antifreeze seems to be coming from uh, the radiator. I, I can't really tell. There's just so much going on here. Yeah, it's still leaking right now. Everything is just still coming down. It's, it's pretty much gonna drain everything out of the system. So I'm pretty sure it's something to do with the front. Uh, maybe it's just too much pressure. Um, something blue, obviously. We don't know what it is. So I don't want to say that the uh, blue devil didn't work, but something happened. And it happened um, enough to there was too much pressure and it blew the radiator. You know, I, I, don't, I don't know what could have gone wrong. It was driving fine for the past week. I've been driving it. Nothing has been happening, uh, but it's been idling well. Uh, the coolant level never dropped. Uh, I, I've been checking it almost every day and see the coolant level. Still didn't even drop yet. Well, I mean, this is just the overflow. You can see there's steam coming out of here though. So I'm pretty sure the radiator blew. It could just be a coincidence, honestly. Um, I don't know. I don't know what to, uh, what to think anymore. I've I keep running into trouble with this uh, car, one problem after another. Anyways, this was just an update for you guys. Uh, as soon as the weather just uh, gets a little bit better outside, I'm gonna pull it in and see exactly what happened. Um, I'll try to make a video on that so you guys are able to watch along. Okay, alright guys, I'll talk to you in the next one.